This module allows to quickly digitize the face map information and print the reports for them. It can be found in the Geology category of ProMine and this video will give a short overview of its main functions. Let's start with this drawing that shows the survey walls of my drift. Two older face maps have already been inserted. A third one is to be added at the new drift front. We just select the command Create Face Map and mark the location of the map. A section will be cut along that direction and we just confirm that this is the correct direction. In the following window, we can give the section a name and enter or pick the correct floor elevation. We can also modify the grid spacing. The grid will be inserted directly on the section. If a mistake was made and the face map is not at the correct locations, there are commands to move the face map. Now we can use polylines to define the borders between rock types. We're going to use an easy contour right now, but the structure can be as complex as needed. As a last step for the drawing of the map, we can hatch the different areas with the lithologies that can be set up within ProMine and assign different grades to the areas. The center area is our vein and is called zone 1. We assign the corresponding gold its silver value and it is automatically colored in a solid red as this is a setup, but any kind of hatch and color can be selected. The left area is going to be hatched using zone 2. This area has no valuable material. Then the last area on the right is going to be zone 3, which still has some lower values of gold and silver. Next we can insert a report about this face map. Just select the command and assign a name, a round length and a grade type to the report. The length is used to calculate the tonnage. We want the report to be about gold and silver, want to report about the different categories and use a density from the rock type. As we wanted to have different categories, we can now assign those to the different lithologies. The categories are also completely customizable and for this example we just have one for waste and one for processing. Both zone 2 and 3 will go to the waste dump and so we assign the category waste and the zone 1 will go to the processing plant. So we assign it to the processing. After all areas have been assigned a category, we select OK and the report is inserted. The report output can additionally be done in a file. In the report we can see the average grade and tonnages for the different categories and the total. Finally switching back to plan view we can also make a weighted average about all inserted reports. We just select the command and then all desired face maps and a new report will be inserted. This concludes this short overview of the face mapping module. If you have any questions about this or other modules of ProMine, please write us at info at ProMine.com. Thanks for watching.